Brain Space. Uh, hi, and welcome to this uh, special edition of Brain Space, in which we've been fortunate enough to procure this amazing new video clip from London, which is just like an amazing statement about um, all kinds of stuff. Um, um, we're going to roll it in now. Just check this out. It's excellent. That was amazing. Um, right, we're fortunate enough to have with us in the studio tonight Tata from the video clip who's um, with us. Um, it's good. Welcome to Australia, Tata. Um, how's the seat? All right? It's okay. Um, you okay. Um, okay? Do you want a drink of water, munchy, anything? Okay. I'm okay. Right, um, right. <laughs> Question A, number one, part three. Um, where did you get the inspiration for that excellent clip? Right. Um... Well, the band and I flew to Berlin to right. pick up the... Right. And um, when we arrived there, I saw this great wall. I mean, it was wow. great. And I thought, that's what Umpty Dumpty was about. Right. I, I don't know... Um, I don't know if they know about it here. No, they don't. They don't. No, they don't. They don't. But, like, back home, um, we have an old saying, which right. is, go to work on an egg. <laughs> like, for Britain's rights, um, the egg is an ancient servility symbol. <laughs> and then my favourite bit was, is when a Nazi nurse rolls the egg down the red carpet, right? It was just like a comment too. And um, then Humpty Dumpty gets incarcerated in an uh, institution, <laughs> right? And, um, which is a comment about political dissidents in the Soviet Union and the right for the individual to protest against the evils against all humanity, um, right? Um, what we hoped that the right. clip would say, right, right was yeah. that... Um, Nobody need ever again in the history of the world right. be ashamed of singing Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> That's what I mean. That's what I meant. That's what I meant. Right, like, um, like you started out in the industry with uh, bulk handicaps, right? Like you come from a, a wealthy upper class family. <laughs> I had to have a special voice coach right. to get me a working class accent. Right. Um, it's an excellent accent, right. Great. In order to get on in the industry, a lot of people in the industry have had to re relate to a lot of other people in the industry in a bed type situation, right? Um, <laughs> I mean, have you had to relate around much? No. <laughs> um, no, I think I can... I think I can truthfully say that before I started, I was well and truly related. Um, my uncle owned a recording company and my dad bought me a studio and mum bought me a townhouse so I wouldn't have to commute. <laughs> 
Excellent, <laughs> excellent. Um, so you were able to avoid um, having to raise your own funds and all that capitalistic garbage, right? right. Um, like your manager must be an amazing guy. He got you into the chart in 10 days, he's right? He's great, the he's great, my manager. Like right, he right. said to me, um, right, darling, if you want to wait for talent, right, right, it could be 10 years. So I just got in there and I started. And I right, did right, amazing. Like, Talent is a Western capitalistic hang-up, right? <laughs> now, the, the chariot and the costume and the makeup. where did you get the inspiration for that? This single is lifted off, by the way, from the um, album um, album. Um, uh, and it's, uh, right, uh, where did you get the inspiration for the costume, etc.? Et the costume, the chariot, Bodicea. I don't know if they know about her either. They don't, She's they don't. Um, no, they don't. An old, <laughs> an old warrior queen, right? Right, right. Um, um, the Anglo-Saxon days, right? Right. And the makeup wasn't so much makeup as right. war paint. Excellent. From right. an ancient Anglo-Saxon vegetable. And right. This is the uh, theme of my next album, which is going to be more middle of the road. <laughs> I know, I know. Excellent. Um, I wonder if you uh, could um, sign this oh, album for me. Oh, um, Yeah. Um, <laughs> like, um, and by the way, if you uh, got anywhere to crash for the weekend.